Hello friends welcome to Dr Rajkumar's learning app in today's topic we are going to learn about phosphines have you wondered what do you guys see when you close your eyes why don't you close your eyes for a minute and try to note down the things that's appearing to you did you see anything yes isn't this fascinating that you don't need light to activate your visual system when you close your eyelids you guys might see the clouds geometrical shapes white flashes many flashes of colors and many more patterns you might be wondering why you see such things and do you know what this is called the technical term for this sensation of light and colors produced by stimulation other than light is called phosphine here when i say phosphine do not confuse it with phosphine which is a colorless flammable very toxic gas which is classified as nitrogen hydride so what is phosphin a phosphin is nothing but the phenomenon of seeing light without light entering the eye the word phosphin comes from the greek word phos that is light and phainin that is to show can we experience this phosphines well you just experienced it when i asked you to close your eyes so how do you experience this phenomenon phosphines can be induced by pressure on the eye that is an intense sneeze hearty laughter coughing blowing your nose standing up too quickly can induce phosphines scientific study of meditation phosphines have also been reported by meditators in buddhist psychology and philosophy this simply refers to form shapes colors sounds etc perceived during meditation scientific study of buddhist meditation paper presented reports of various meditation induced light experiences derived from buddhist practitioners when a study was conducted out of 22 participants nine individuals voluntarily reported lights and other forms of luminous experiences among these reports the level of light of the meditation environment varied according to the setting and the time of the day and was not intentionally manipulated they saw curtain of light vivid dreams night sky shimmering lights white spots pleasant pulsations of colors etc coming on do you think phosphines are visible only when you close your eyes people who are confined in dark rooms for long periods without visual stimulation can also experience this phosphines and this term is called as prisoner's cinema prisoner's cinema is the phenomenon of a light show of various colors that appear out of the darkness the phenomenon is reported by prisoners who are confined to dark cells and others who were in dark rooms voluntarily or not for long periods of time it has also been reported by truck drivers pilots and practitioners of intense meditation astronauts and other individuals who have been exposed to certain types of radiation have witnessed a similar phenomenon scientists believe that the cinema is a result of phosphines combined with the physiological effects of prolonged exposure to darkness others have suggested a connection between the form the light takes and their neolithic cave paintings thus phosphine appear to those who ingest psychedelic drug entopic hallucination geometrical hallucination or phosphines are one of the most commonly reported visual effects of psychedelic phosphines are a sensation of light caused by excitation of the retina by mechanical or electrical means pressure phosphines can be created by applying pressure to the eyeballs through closed eyelids flicker phosphines are created in response to stroboscopic pulses of light kinetic phosphines are created in response to physical impact to the head sometimes referred to as seeing stars the fast flicker rate they could see kaleidoscopic nature skeletons clowns dots circles honeycomb spiders insects etc scientists brindley and rushton in 1974 once successfully created a type of visual prosthesis that allowed certain blind people to see braille spots using phosphines this device only works on blind people whose brains were capable of processing visual information such as those who once could see but lost their sight in an accident or the like 